Hi guys, so I suppose you guys are here to find out how can you lose up to 10 to 15 pounds in one month. We're going to go ahead and get into the video and I'm going to tell you guys what I am currently doing. Disclaimer, I am not a doctor. I'm just here to show you guys what I'm doing right now. I just want to lose weight and I want to try different things out and see what works for me. There's a lot of people out there that want someone, you know, or need someone that they can relate to. I wanted to go ahead and do a review on this, you know, just so we can um, see if this really does work. So, I wrote some um, things down in this little book here just to help me stay on track about what I want to talk about because I don't want to miss anything. And I want you guys to know my full experience on this. Just a little bit about me because I like to, when I, when I see reviews, I like to um, watch the person's reviews that I most relate to. For one, I'm 25 years old. I do have children. I do have some baby fat and things like that. I have never been really um, big, but I decided that I wanted to start losing weight because long story short i got into a really healthy relationship and i know you guys do know when you get into a healthy relationship with someone all you guys do is eat good food and you guys are just living your best life so i know a lot of you ladies right now are definitely can relate to that so me and my boyfriend we were just eating out we just didn't really have a care in the world i was not the smallest at that point but i was like i was happy with my weight at that time i was around 175 but i really didn't look like it i was kind of small when i started the venture me i started um at 200 pounds so you guys know i was um insecure about my weight my stomach started getting big and i have this type of boyfriend that if i'm getting big or if i'm getting thick at all and i feel insecure he will not tell me he act like he doesn't notice anything he just tell me like you look good to me, you beautiful and things like that, which is a good thing. You know, I appreciate my boyfriend for not making me feel insecure during this time that I was gaining weight. I'll say I started gaining weight last October. I was eating heavy breakfast, grits, all of these things that shit I should never have been eating. Like my face got chubby and everything. So I'm going to start telling you guys about my experience with this, how you get it, how much it cost, how much weight I lost. So, if you're interested in seeing that part, go ahead and stay tuned. What made me get Fentramine? I was going to the doctor, just doing my normal visit, my normal six months checkup, and it was a new doctor. I live in Arizona, there's not many black doctors. So usually when I go to the doctor, I may be shy, or I'm in Arizona, I haven't really found a doctor that I was comfortable with. And it was my first time going to go see this doctor. I was so excited because she was a black doctor. I literally just started spilling everything out, like what exactly was wrong with me, anything that been on my mind, any issues that I was having that I wanted her to live in too. And the main thing that I wanted to talk to her about was that I had gained weight. Or like, listen, I don't want to be fat. I have this type of boyfriend that definitely will probably let me get fat because he thinks I'm beautiful, you know, no matter if I'm fat or whatever. He just doesn't really care. I told her about it and she was like, you know what, if you're really stressing about this, I think I want you to try something. I had never heard of me or anything about any weight loss pill that was actually, you know, something that worked. She was like, um, I want you to try this pill, but first before you try the pill, um, Fentramine pill, I, I have to test out your heart. And you know, you have to do blood work and things like that just to make sure that you're healthy. So guys, before taking this pill, you do have to be 100% healthy. Like, um, she had to check my heart to make sure that I wouldn't, I don't have any heart issues or anything like that. Because it is, um, I know that the pill kind of makes your heart rate jump a little bit. Like your doctor will let you know if, you know, this pill is something that you can do if it's safe for you and your body. I came back about three weeks later and she asked me, um, did I decide if I wanted to do the thing for me? So I told her, you know, during those three weeks, I had a lot to think about. I told her like, yeah, you know what, I think I need to do this because the more and more I look in the mirror at my stomach, 
I'm getting more and more disgusted. I was not trying to work out or anything like that. Like I'm not a very active person because I do a lot of things. Like I work, I have kids and things like that. I, I, I do a lot of things in a day. So I, would, I don't know if that's an excuse or not. I think it is probably because I can probably find some time to work out. But anywho, I went back within those three weeks and she gave me the pill. FYI, you can only get this pill from your doctor. So you have to have a prescription for this pill. She gave me the pill and um, I went to go pick it up. Insurance does not cover this. Think for me, you have to pay out of pocket. Pharmacist told me that I had to pay out of pocket because my insurance did not cover it. The pill costed um, $50, but the lady at the CVS was nice enough to put like some type of discount on there. So I only paid $30 for the pill. I only, yeah, I only paid $30 for Fentramine. And um, she gave me the Fentramine 30 mg capsule. So this is what it kind of, this is what it looks like. She gave me enough for 30 days because after 30 days, after my first 30 days, I'm supposed to go back to her so she can check and see my progress and see how I've been doing. A lot of people say you're supposed to work out and eat healthy. My doctor did not tell me to work out. You know, I feel like you get the most results when you do work out. I have not been working out. Um, I have not been eating really healthy, but at the same time, I haven't been eating really bad neither because what this pill does is it takes your appetite away. I started the pill on Tuesday, September 4th because I know that I was going to want to eat some holiday food. <laughs> I think that was Labor Day if I'm not mistaken. Um, today it is Friday, September 21st. Okay. And it's 11.20 at night. I have actually been on this pill for approximately, let's see, September 4th. For almost three weeks. Now, I don't have a scale at home. I decided to step on the scale at this little urgent care and whatnot to see how many pounds I had lost. Long story short, I was so excited, guys. Oh my God. I lost literally 10 pounds. I lost 10 whole freaking pounds in almost three weeks. Why that is so amazing to me is because I did not work out. Now I did tell myself that for the first 30 days I wanted to see how the pill made my body feel before I just started going hard in the gym. I'm going to start going, you know, going to the gym on my second um, dose of um, 30 days, which is gonna be October 4th. That's when I'm going to start going to the gym and see how many, um, see what the difference is, see how much weight I lose while I'm actively working out and eating healthy. But guys, I literally lost 10 whole pounds without working out. Just, I know a lot of people have a lot of symptoms and I'm going to go ahead and let you guys know how the pill made me feel. So you guys can see if it's going to be something that you can deal with or not. My first day taking the pill, I, I okay, so I work at a, a desk job. I'm, I do tech support, so I, you know, I sit at a desk all day using my brain and things like that, thinking. So my first day I took the pill, um, I noticed very quickly that you do get cotton mouth, which um, causes you to um, be thirsty a lot, which literally, I drink so much water in a day. I'm telling you, like I have to have water like all day, every day. My mouth is super dry. I had a slight headache, but it wasn't like anything unbearable. It was just a small headache. Nothing too bad, nothing that I felt like I had to take an Advil or anything for. I felt like for once in a long time, I was not thinking about eating anything so good and coming home and from work and relaxing, trying to eat some good food or eating no heavy breakfast, trying to eat grits and bacon and all of this stuff. I was not thinking about none of that. My mind was finally doing things that I really was trying hard to do that I could not do without the pill. I mean, I probably could, but 
not as quickly as I did on the peel. I do plan on staying, you know, not eating so much as I did and things like that once I'm off the peel. The peel is just basically a kickstart to train you how to get your mind think not thinking about food. I definitely did not feel the urge to eat a lot. I did see a lot of people that use the 37 MGs. They did have a lot of symptoms and they said that they really couldn't eat as much. Me, I felt like there were times that I felt hungry, like literally after like seven o'clock. But the first day I did not eat a lot. I would say a day I don't eat more than 1200 calories. Um, but around seven o'clock, I started to hear my stomach growl. But basically the only symptoms that I had on this pill was um, it gave me cotton mouth and it gave me a slight headache. Nothing else. You know what? It made me feel a little dizzy too, but that was literally only in the first week. After the first week, I was good to go. It didn't make me feel um, no type of way. I'm trying to keep this as short as possible, but it is a lot of information. So I may have to create another video just to keep you guys um, updated and give you guys a little bit more information um, about this pill. I told you guys how you get it, which is you get it by getting it prescribed by your doctor. I told you guys how much it costs. It costs approximately $50, but I did get it on a discount. And I told you guys, I started off at 200 pounds. I am now 190 pounds. I told you guys when I started it, I started it September 4th and the symptoms that I had, just a headache and dry cotton mouth. If there is anybody else out there that that's taking it currently and you guys wanna keep up with each other's, um, you know, progress just let me know i would be more than interested to know how is the pill treating you and things like that thank you so much for watching this video i really do appreciate it i do plan on giving you guys more updates and i might make another video getting very detailed about what my body looks like because i know you you, you can't see me i'm sitting in my kitchen table chair but just know this no matter what shape you are, honey, to make sure that you stay confident, okay? Stay strong, ladies. We gonna push through this. We gonna get to 2019. We're not gonna be eating like crazy. And even if you do decide to eat crazy, make sure you stay confident, but most importantly, try to get healthy because that's my goal right now. I know we can reach those low points where we get insecure about our weight you need to first love yourself and love your body before you can start making changes once again guys my name is kyra you guys can follow me on instagram and make sure you guys just stay connected with me stay tuned in i do plan on making a lot of other videos i have a lot of things that i can talk about i have a a lot of things going on. I have a relationship. I have kids. I'm a good cook. I can show you guys some of the things that I cook up while I'm eating healthy. I keep these very close to me when I'm at work because that's the time that I usually gain a lot of weight is when I'm at work sitting at my desk eating all this junk food, okay? <laughs> but I'm going to let you guys go because I'm definitely chatting and running my mouth, okay? Thank you guys so much for tuning in.